Alright, so this is a suggestion via a donation. The name of the video is The Sensitive Drill Sergeant. This is coming from the show SNL. Let's check it out. Yo, G, if I hadn't been in the army, I'd still be in the street gang today. What's up? Come right. on, man, no way. Way, my way. friend. Ted Hunt! Oh. What in the hell's name is going on here? This ain't no garden party! You're lucky I don't take you pukes out in the middle of the base and stomp your asses into the ground. Do you understand me? Yes, yes sir. sir! Private Riley, what do we call ourselves? Soldiers, sir! Then act like a you piece of crap! Wow. Now, the re Guys, is that how it really happens? Let me know. The reason I dismissed the rest of the platoon is to discuss a matter of extreme importance with you. Right. Recently, I started dating a rather classy lady <laughs> whose company I enjoy immensely. Okay. But who I... For some reason, continue to keep it arm's length. I am unclear as to exactly how I am to proceed. Perhaps you have some suggestions. <laughs> Do you think this is funny, Private Peterson? <laughs> Drop and give me 20, you insensitive dog turd. Yes, sir. Do you need to be a NASA scientist to realize how uncomfortable I am <laughs> opening myself up to you right now? <laughs> yes, why are you doing it? Bro, bro, why is he doing this? Well, maybe that's the problem right there, Sarge. Uh, right. Do you think we're having a comfortable little chat over a couple of beers at the Regal Bingle? <laughs> no, I, sir! I am not your friend, son. Do you understand? Yes, sir! If you have some thoughts on my situation, you address me as your superior right. and not like one of your ass pals. <laughs> well, what? sir, you mentioned that the woman was super classy, sir. Okay. That I did, Private. Perhaps you feel that if you expose your true self to her, she might be disappointed, sir. Wow. Right. Look who joined the army. Private Freud. <laughs> <laughs> and what about my true self would disappoint her? Private Freud. How many people know you? Bro, he's so close to his face. Well enough to answer their questions. Her. Private Freud. How many people know you? Well enough to answer their questions, sir. Don't you get smart with me, son, or I'll tear your forehead off with my teeth. Wow. A fair rejection prevents you from being intimate, sir. Give me that advice again, Private Oprah. What is going on? Perhaps a fair rejection prevents you from being intimate, sir. Why is it close to his face, though? That may be, son, but I'm certainly not afraid of making my boot intimate with your privates. Private! Permission to speak, sir! Well, wonders never cease. Bro, they're all just giving him, like, really good advice and he's yelling at him. Quiver lip, quiver lip, quiver, quiver. Look what we got here! A talking horse's ass! <laughs> <laughs> what do you have to say, private horse's ass? Right. One thing I have learned, sir, is the okay. communication is the cornerstone of all good relationships, sir! My advice would be to communicate your fears to this woman, sir! Just how am I supposed to do that, private horse's ass? <laughs> Guys! When both my parents were non-communicative, and I was not taught the necessary skills! Bad habits can't be broken, sir! Exactly. The entire psychiatric community is built on that premise, sir! Exactly. Sir! You still think this is a giggle <laughs> fest, private son of a bitch? No, wow. sir. This is some serious stuff, sir. Then what can you possibly add to this discussion, private? Bro, he's spitting all over this man's face, guys. All right. I've never That's seen wild. you with a woman. Don't ask, don't tell, sir. <laughs> don't play games with me, boy. Do not. <laughs> Regardless of my sexual orientation, sir, I believe I can show you how communication can help a relationship. And just how do you propose to do this, private candy ass? <laughs> making an honest connection, sir. For example, I would like to sincerely apologize for the insensitive way I acted earlier, sir. I was uncomfortable with your vulnerability, sir, and I chose to max my anxiety with a giggle. I was thoughtless and rude. I hope you can forgive me, sir. You are forgiven, brother. Permission to hug you, sir. Right. Permission granted. <laughs> All right, gentlemen. That's enough of this slumber party. Right. Now listen up. Okay. Let me remind you, this discussion does not make us family members, so do not come up to me and put your arm around my shoulder. I will rip it off. You won't. God, Peterson, I thought he was going to kill He's you. Bumping my head. I did not say any soldiers. One more thing. I love you very much. Eddie's. 
<laughs> Guys, that is that is strange. Listen, I've never been in the military, so I don't really know, um, you know, exactly what exactly is, uh, you know, all of it's about. But I can definitely see on, on like movies and like TV shows that generally someone named Drill Sergeant is absolutely hmm, scary in your face. Right. Um, all in your business. But uh, this very specific drill sergeant is very in touch with his sensitive side and uh, great title for his sketch, guys. Absolutely. Right. Uh, <laughs> guys, let me know in the comments. Uh, the next one of these I should be checking out from SNL. And I will get into that as soon as I possibly can. All right. Listen, you guys all have an absolutely amazing day. Enjoy it thoroughly.